Hello everyone, my name is Liam Knight, or Emma for short. Welcome back to the channel, and this is the ninth game in the 31 Days of Horror that we are currently doing on the channel. Today we are playing A Night on the Farm. I know this was meant to be Stray Souls, but um, or do not open, I don't know which one it was, but um, that accidentally got corrupted. It didn't fully record, so we're doing this game. And am I in or? Oh. Interesting. So we crashed. I'm hoping this video does record. If um, it doesn't, I don't know what I'm going to do. Love the visuals though. No turning back. It's the farm. Is it through here? Nope. Is that feather away? I'm not sure. I'm not a fan of the field of view. Okay. Got a lot of fridges. Nothing in them. Alex, I need you to change out the electronic lock on the kitchen door for my to kind of go on hide a spare key close by. Maybe stick it under one of those big rocks behind the garage or something. Yeah, it's against protocol, but I'm still getting locked out every time. The damn thing that's had some malfunction and massive bill. P.S. There's a spare flashlight in the drawer here. Thanks, bud. Okay, so... So a spare key in the back. There it is. Also, if um, I'm just curious, um, if any of my viewers, you guys. Or girls have played the new Silent Hill yet? Um, I'm absolutely enjoying that. Um, very faithful to the original, but here's a note. To all, the dryer was acting up again, and while it turns out the key holder isn't strong enough to hold wet towels, oops, the towels tore the darn thing right off the wall. I don't have time to fix it. This place is a mess, so I'm just going to put the keys in the cabinet with the words Karen. P.S. If anyone's in the generator key, it was here with the shed key. That's a lot of keys. Yeah, I actually played um, the original Silent Hill this year just to get ready for the new one. And fun fact about me, I never thought I would play Silent Hill. Um, Karen, Alex, whoever sees this first, I had to run downstairs for an emergency meeting not late. Can you fire this tape away off the other one in the office? I'll get back to it there. Thanks, Bill. Yeah, ooh. Mothman? Yeah. 
Is this thing even recording? Okay, where do I start? Um, this feels a bit awkward. I guess I should say, well, if I'm being honest, I guess I'm nervous. I mean, who wouldn't be? I'm not exactly what sure I'd say. I don't want anyone to think I'm not having second thoughts. Okay, but let's be real. This as well, it's super fringe, right? I guess I'm torn between feeling like I drew the short straw and feeling like I'm obviously the best one to go through with this. Either way, the tapes are probably a good idea. I get it. I really do. But um, this is probably it for the first one. Bill, let me know this is okay. I'll come on by. Yeah, I never thought I'd play Silent Hill because um, I grew up with Resident Evil as a kid. I played Resi Five with my dad and uncle. And also played Resident Evil um, 6 with them. Well, mainly my dad. And growing up, I literally thought, well, when I play Silent Hill, if I'm a busy fan. But that didn't last long. <clears throat> I must say, I wish I played it sooner. It was like, Beautiful game, but at the same time, I'm glad I played it when I was. I think I played it when I was 18. I got it when I was like 16 on the Xbox, and then rebought it. Well, sorry, I got it when I was 16. Try to play it, couldn't figure it out, and then I moved um, when I was 18. I decided to replay it. Actually, no. 19. So I got it when I was like 16, 17. If I'm. Sorry, I'm trying to figure this out. 16, 17, I got it. And then. When. I was 19 this year, I played it. Ready for the remake. And I really enjoyed it. So after I finish Silent Hill 2, I'm definitely gonna. I am definitely going to be moving on to playing Silent Hill 3. To all, I'm almost watching them a key quality. I shouldn't have to say this, but being on laundry duty doesn't make your mom. It doesn't make me your mom. You need to think better about the hand by yourself. Okay. Not the hamper. That's a hamper, is it not? Also, sorry if my voice sounds a bit weird, I'm a little ill. Okay, we have the blue key, which I think from the video it states it's the shed key. So that's more progress. So that's good. Strange toy, yes. Anything of use in here? Oh, what was that? I found it in the living. Okay, so we've got another key card. A lot of key cards for this family. Don't know what they're doing. To all two things, I want to relax with them before heading down to work, but I can't find the TV remote. Anyways, do we actually pick pack them? Too. I'm not sure if I where I should report this because it's on a bit crazy, but as far as I saw Jimmy in the corner of the yard and like kind of by the shed, but where the fence runs on it, I can't feel weird, right? P.S. I still can't get over how good those DVDs look and sound too, Alex. So one of yours was at the corner. Okay, there's the key card. No toy, toy collector, okay.
Okay, I just wanna. I don't take credit for calling that thing Mothman. I just remember my partner playing this. I didn't see her play it, I just heard her talking about it. I had my headphones on, to be honest, so I couldn't hear because I wanted to experience it myself. But I remember her saying Mothman, and honestly, if my partner is watching this, it does sound like Moth. It does look like Mothman a lot. Okay, what's this one say? I'm just gonna let it play. Okay, maybe I can it. Today was normalish. I talked with Bill for a while. It felt good. It felt normal. Like he wasn't going through his checklist for once. It felt like it used to. Like we were friends. Did you know he used to be a big traveling into traveling? Yeah, I guess he's been all over the world. God, I should have traveled more. I'm talking like it's all over. It's not, but things definitely feel different. I've been having these strange dreams. He has one. It's kind of mundane, but possibly worth mentioning. I was walking through the house, but I mean, like, literally, I could walk through the walls. I could see Karen was stacking boxes in the living room, and Bill slid something behind one of the pictures in the hallway. I think they were arguing about something. I hear they keep ordering them around, so maybe it was something about that. Who knows? I think it's all there for now. I think that's all for now. Okay, so... One of the paintings... Requires power. Oh, there you go. Today's login for you know what. 443. Okay, so 012502. That's the code. But we don't have power. Perfect. Okay, what's this? I'm assuming that's the generator key. I'm hoping. I'm glad at least like for one horror event, it's like the first horror game I've actually played that's an indie one that actually has put stuff in notes that help you, which is nice. Zero, one, two, five, zero, two. Established 1999, category plain side stat, status operational, staff 6, specimen 1, okay. Lab supplies, I keep finding these strange toys around the property, looks like a small robot and a giant eyeball, are you guys doing a scavenger hunt about my bill? Maybe we should use the bullet board to communicate instead of leaving those little the place, Karen. We're removing Jamie and the specimen. I'm still waiting for information. So, something about jobs. And how they need to fill their reports in. All team have been sick with frequent some headaches. Traffic levels higher than normal. So about traffic nearby, we're missing a lot of metal trash cans, six ish, it's in the basement. So Bill and Karen have day shift. Our current focus is as follows monitor gym, Mrs. Stockley, the special and research maintained site security. The call for the basement keypad is 092501. What is the assessment change update? I'm going to click here after you've hit the button. 092501. 092501. 092501. Perfect. I thought I got it wrong there. So I'm assuming this little thing, this little monster, this little demon, this mothman is their specimen. And it's called Jamie. Maybe it's that kid. I 
I'm assuming this is what my partner was on about when she was like SCP-087. I think it's called the stairwell or it's 167. I could be wrong. One eight, it's SCP-187 or 067. One of the most iconic ones. It does feel like that. It's cold. It's cold. Nice Among Us looking at suits. I know they're gonna. I know they're obviously like when you put them on the this part folds up, but it looks like Among Us in a way. Tool, so, behold my latest side project, the P-Type helmet. Feel free to test out when you get a chance. Yeah, it looks kind of silly for now, but I've already noticed a significant reduction in headaches in my other tests. Once I build another, we should be able to use it for communication too. Also, once this gets approved, we can strap it on Jamie and potentially amplifying her budding abilities. The future is now, Alex. Oh, God. So I guess this means I can communicate with um, Jamie now, which apparently it's a girl. Which would make it Moth Girl. Okay, so we've already read all this. Oh god, I didn't even realise that you were a dead body. I thought you were a chair. Tape const. Yeah, the play tape doesn't even work. So I found a place. I found a place. I've been there a few times now. It's really hard to describe. Um, it's dark. Okay, I'm just gonna sum it. I'm just gonna read it because that was taking too long. So, I found a place, I've been there a few times now, it's really hard to describe, um, it's dark, there's a constant, real description, descriptive, right, the problem is it's only constant, the space is actually a bit different every time. At first it was like I was bringing part of a mystery along for the ride, um, kind of like when you dream and your brain is clearly working out issues from the previous day, I can recognise parts of myself in there, parts of us, but that's all starting to fade the more I visit the more foreign it becomes to be honest I tr find it kind of comfort and free and even I mean sure part of me is worried I won't be able to get back but a part of me is okay with that too I felt like a prisoner here lately so sure I think about staying who wouldn't and I might and I might if I wasn't worried about the consequence not staying but of what we've done If you're reading this, we think it was Jimmy. We're not entirely sure. One by one, everyone started bleeding from their face. My god, that sound isn't even real. Is this, is this all in my head? I locked the doors to the main chambers and put elevator A1 into stasis. I can't access the other elevator from these terminals, so last I checked, Jamie was still in her room. In her testing, I wouldn't go in there, but if you absolutely have to, I changed the code to the date they captured the damn thing. Fitting, right? I think I'm going to sleep now. My face feel hot. It's difficult to write. When did they capture her? Nine zero nine thirty. Zero nine thirty nine eight. Zero nine zero three nine eight. Zero nine. Wait no. Zero nine thirty nine. I'm not going to try and melt my face, is she? Also, she's practically already escaped, so... You know, I don't know what you want to do about that. So 
successfully proceed to draw 0.5 milli as X01 from A1 injected at a PO1 document affects mental, physical, verified potential application, military, scientific, other volunteer information, James Soto, sex, female, age 29, blood type O, post position R&D, witness, so someone will get released, and you inject it into the neck. Arm, abdomen, leg, back. Sample should be stored in a secure container at 37 to 43 Celsius at all times. Generally, samples are from over 20 hours before the samples left from the to be inspired. things okay What we pointing at, gentlemen? Or ladies? I wish there was more explanation for what this guy actually is and how he got here. I'm not entirely sure I understand that, but here we go again. Oh, I thought it was like squishing through that there. Oh, hello, Mothman. Yeah, it does feel like you are, Mothman. Even I can see some... Yeah, even I can see some, like, accurate see accuracy in that 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 is mothman or like somewhat meant to be inspired by mothman i mean i like mothman and i would hope he wouldn't melt my face right so the subject was not in her room this morning how is this possible of course the camera feed cuts out right before she disappears we spent the entire morning searching for her only return to ts5 approximately three hours later and find her laying in her bed explanation i was to close communicating with it so i stayed there longer they recommended 24 hours so missing 
Check vision. Oh shit. Subject is physically and mentally healthy. Recommended proceeding as planned. For about a week in, there's definitely a change in the subject's behaviour, though whether it's related to a general stress or the injections has yet to be determined. Let's get the spine down and make sure she gets to bed at each night. Two weeks in a row, we're a little late on the injection this morning due to a conflict with the subject worth mentioning. Not only has the swelling around the subject's recent injection points subsided, but some of the injection points from day one to four are non-existent. Three weeks in, subject is showing increasingly strange levels of brain activity at night. During the day, she's been often... She often recounts strange dreams from the night before. No, she insists they're not dreams, but rather places she's visiting. She mentions traversing dark spaces with puzzle-like access points. She calls them doorways. We have we've been drawing her in the whiteboards. Okay, so this must be her bedroom. Bill, take a listen to this when you get a chance. I think she's losing it. I feel bad. What did we expect? All of this just lose her to facility 7. What are they thinking, Karen? PS4 has changed the damn CC code again. Try 121291. It doesn't have to work on find me. Alright, this is the last tip. There's no time you'd had every opportunity to listen to me to take this seriously, to take me seriously, but you think I'm crazy, look, I get it. So I have to try something new and I need you to understand what's at stake, yeah. This is going to sound dramatic. Everything, everything is at stake, yeah, but who knows? I'm pretty sure we doomed us and not like us here on the fake farm. Us like us people, us. Uh, how the F, well, how should I know? I'm still learning, assimilating. Maybe it's not my problem. No, I don't mean that. Not yet, anyway. We were on the right track with the helmet. Yes, I know about the helmet. The cry, the headaches. There was just a small piece of it in our range, our spectrum. Our senses are so limited, so to use it was subtle. Sometimes a ringing in the air, an impulse to act against your will like a puppet. When I was injected, I think it did something. It made me more like them, but I'm still having trouble communicating. They don't know I belong here. They don't... They know I don't belong here. Belong there. So yeah, I'm going to let it out. It's the only way to prevent whatever's about to happen you're going to help me if I don't accidentally kill you in the process, wish me luck. So... I am very confused. Is... Jamie the monster? Or... Is Jamie the monster, or is Jamie this woman that's been attacked? And is this thing the thing that you try to let out? So many questions. Emergency exit override destroy specimen open specimen chamber. Okay, so I've seen there is three endings. Let's open it. I don't know if you're going to kill me. But from the sounds of it, you don't belong here. And honestly, if you are Mothman, I like Mothman and I want Mothman to be free. To live is to abide, to shape, to exist, to exist. Fear is a sickness, a weapon. I would say, personally, I'm just going off like my opinion, um, for what I would say in real life, the trial. 
Hopefully it's just come on, it's fucked up. The control is to guide, to manipulate, to harness. To manipulate. Compassion is a strength. To die is to begin anew. Death is never the end. Conscious. Consciousness is. I don't know what consciousness means. I mean, I think it means you're awake, so I'm gonna say bridge. Your actions recorded, your thoughts weighed, your gift forget, forged. You're learning from me. Is that what I might want to sign? You're learning, like, from me. The warmth washed over my vessel as I watched the stranger from afar. Their action, completely in tune with their core, might have saved an entire species. An entire planet. Maybe an entire realm. In the end, the stranger's triumph is their own. My only regret is that I failed with the others. After all, the stranger's presence was a stroke of luck. A last ditch effort to undo all the cruelty and chaos we'd created. The doom we'd spilled. Was I wrong to absorb an innocent in all of this? Well, that is for the stranger to decide, isn't it? I think I'll inquire in the coming days, but for now, I will watch and wait. Will the stranger be drawn to the sound of the source as I am? And if so, Will they seek it out before or after exploring the myriad of gateways in the traverse? The possibilities are truly infinite. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna make sure this is still recording. Okay, yes it is. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was Night on the Farm. I really enjoyed that. Um, I'm sure there was like more lore on what that monster was from the notes, but I personally didn't understand it. I still enjoy it. I love that, like, them graphics, like, pixelated monsters are... I'm a sucker for it, like Puppet Combo. But thank you so much for watching. I hope this video actually did get recorded. And I'm hope I hope you're enjoying the 31 days of October as much as I am. But till the next one, I hope to see you in the next video that I do. Goodbye!